Good morning. Today we're here at Meyer. We're going to go in and check out some of the sales. It is Memorial Day week. We're going to see what sales they got. This is one of the best sales of the year, right? Sure. So hopefully they got some good deals. We're going to check out some of the shelves uh, and some of the things you guys have asked about. Let's get to it. Okay, so as soon as we come into Meyer here, I figured I'd start with the middle aisle, see what kind of Memorial Day sales they have going on this week. Um, they do have the Doritos buy one get one free bogo alert and they have pop 649 each uh they have a buy five and save five mixer match deal going on now that is mixer match coca-cola pepsi seven up products uh 649 each with that deal so 749 without the deal that's pretty awesome that's the cheapest we've seen in a long time since I was over here right next to the baby formula, I wanted to do a quick look over, see if they were getting any in, and they have. They have gotten some in. This is good to see. Um, yeah, real good to see. We've been seeing that it's been wiped out all across the country. Um, you know, definitely very low, but good to see they're actually getting some in. This is probably more than we've seen anywhere in the last couple few weeks. They do have a sale going on, two for $8.00 making these four bucks uh six stacks of ritz crackers for four dollars um we've been seeing that it's been going on, you're basically only getting an extra stack so it's 359 for basically five stacks for the regular box at kroger so yeah i don't know you are getting an extra stack for like 40 cents you do have to buy two of them or more you can buy more and it's good to see they have them we've been hearing the ritz crackers has kind of been going out the door again so I did ask somebody in this buy five, say five, is all items that is on this participating thing. So you could you could buy one uh, 24 pack of Coke, a Cheez-It thing here, which let's bring this down to $1.99 a box. That's actually a good deal. We've seen this as high as $3.19, $3.29. Uh, I believe they went down to $3.19 at Kroger. Um, but yeah, bringing that to $1.99 and everything is included in the buy five and say five. But you do have to get multiples of five. It's not like Kroger where you can buy five and then everything after that, you save a dollar. You have to buy five, save five dollars. Somebody left a comment about Fuji apples and that you haven't been able to find them. Very low here. Uh, I wanted to point this out. Somebody mentioned that. And as we went over a little over a week ago, the apples did go up a little bit from $1.59 a pound to $1.79 a pound for the Gala, uh, Granny Smith, Golden Delicious, Red Delicious, Pink Lady, Evercrisp and Envy Apples are $2.69 a pound. Actually, Envy Apples are $2.59 a pound. And they have the Cosmic Crisp Apples for $2.59 a pound. So no sales on apples this week. So they have their cantaloupes and personal watermelons here. $4.99 for a personal watermelon. But they are buy one, get one for a dollar. So that is a great deal. They did lower the price of the corn, the already chucked corn, for $2.99 instead of $3.99, what it was last week. So that's a little bit of a sale, but a really awesome sale. The asparagus here, $1.37 a pound. That's amazing. This is normally $3.09 a pound. Amazing Memorial Day sale. Another really awesome deal that Myers has this week, two-pound strawberries. I got to say, these look very good. $2.49. $2.49 for two pounds. That is $1.25 a pound. That's an amazing deal. Looks like they do have their blackberries again on sale this week. The Driscoll's blackberries, three for five dollars. Uh, that's a pretty good deal. You do have to buy three of them to get the deal. Uh, raspberries, still $3.59 for one six ounce pack. That is ridiculous. But blackberries, that's a pretty decent deal. Down from $2.39 a pack. There are no more sales on grapes. They are $1.99 a pound for the red seedless, $2.49 a pound for the green ones. You know, I would figure that usually the green grapes would go down right about now. They do have the cotton candy grapes, $4.99 a pound. Uh, somebody was talking about these on our live show last Friday night. I don't know. I'd buy a few. Does it say how much they are? Or how much? $5.86. So we got 1.17 pounds. I like the digital scale. Very nice. What do you think of these grapes? They're good. They are very good. So Jess does read a lot of the comments and she remembered that somebody had asked a little while back about the raw walnuts. Well, we found some. Um, 
let's see, they got their 829 a bag uh, for the 16 ounce and then 1229 a bag for the 32 ounce. Um, but yeah, this is the only place. I remember looking for this uh, a little while ago and haven't been able to find them. So at least they have them at Meyer here. Check your local Meyer if you have one. If not, I will keep an eye out. So we do see that the peppers went up 10 cents. They were $1.39 a piece, which was still too much. Uh, $1.49 now. That's that's crazy. And the three pack went up too from $3.49 to uh, $3.59. These were $3.29 forever, and we've seen two price jumps here in the last couple weeks, so I don't know. Hopefully they have a sale on them again. When they do, I'm going to buy up a few. We were actually here at Meyer when I was looking at a comment from one of our longtime viewers that they do have the 80-20 hamburger uh, per pound, $1.99 per pound this week. If you have a Meyer, go to Meyer. $1.99 a pound for the 80-20. 80-20, the better quality. Uh, it's definitely worth it. $1.99 a pound. Buy it up, freeze it. Since we always get comments about mushrooms, we've had a few people ask about portobello mushrooms. I just wanted to show these. They are $5.69, which is a crazy price. But look at these. Look how big these are. These are the biggest portobello mushrooms I've ever seen in my life. So last week, you know, we saw where the produce was pretty thin here in Meyer, and this is uncommon. And we've had a lot of things, uh, you know, we've a lot of products have had trouble coming into the stores again. We've been covering a lot of this stuff. Um, but, you know, it's like we're starting to see, because I've never, uh, you know, a, a few months ago we saw where the produce was getting pretty low here. But Myers has always pretty much stayed on top of it and uh, always able to get it in. So for, them to, for it to be low like this, I don't okay, know. Okay, so be aware if you go to Meyer, at least at our Meyer, they do have the $1.99 uh, hamburger on sale, but they are really bringing it out. Like they're being chintzy. Yeah, they are. Well, they're grind. They can't. They can't bring it out fast well, enough. Well, it's like, what do you expect? It's going to be a dollar ninety nine. You really think people aren't going to buy it up? I mean, come on. Yeah, I know. I don't know why they're not. They're bringing out four packages at a time. Yeah, there's like, like a line of people, people waiting. <laughs> right. So we were able to get. We were only able to get three of them. How many pounds did we get here? This one is two point nine, so three pounds, and this one's three pounds. Three pounds. So and six pounds. This one's just under two. So, uh, um, yeah. So six, seven and a half, probably. Yeah. Seven and a half. But you know, Myers meat is great. They like Jess just told me they probably won't have this sale for probably till next Memorial Day. So maybe July. never again. Yeah. yeah. Or July Fourth, maybe, maybe. So I don't Thanks. know. What else were you saying about? A they lot don't of the have things a lot on of our things list. I need like real specific things, like the barbecue sauce. They don't have. They yeah. don't have the red potatoes. They don't have uh, cube steaks. Okay, so like last week, Meyer is very low on a lot of products. We are starting to notice a lot of emptiness in the stores here in Cincinnati, Ohio. Now, uh, we've heard some other places that are getting very low across the country. Some that are still good. Uh, real quick, wanted to point out this sale. Uh, $1.25 a piece. You do have to buy four, but somebody asked about the Nor pasta sides and you weren't able to find them. Regular price here, $1.35. is kind of ridiculous. Uh, normal price at Kroger, they usually always have a sale, four for five at Kroger. So someone had said in the comments that Meyer was going to be having a lot of sales on coffee this week, and you're right, they are. They've actually got some Dunkin' Donuts. We've been kind of seeing Dunkin' Donuts go out the door lately. Uh, $6.49 on sale from $9.19 of the 12 ounce. 12 ounce now you know these used to be a pound they used to be 16 ounces but that's part of the shrinkflation going on they do have the eight o'clock coffee uh this is also a 12 ounce uh 4.99 down from 7.49 and let's see do they still have this going on okay yeah this deal still goes on until the 28th of may so if you buy ten dollars on anything of the participating um on select coffee products which I guess, yeah, Duncan would be included. Uh, buy $10, you get $2 off your next trip. If you buy $15, you get $4 off. So this would be a really good way to save this week. You could buy three of these, get $4 off, you know, your next Meyer trip. Do notice Pete's coffee went back up. But yeah, that's a pretty good deal. And they do have quite a selection of the ones that are part of that. Also, they have some coffee on here, part of the buy five and save five mix or match deal. Uh, they're following suit with Kroger with that, but again, 
it's not exactly the same as Kroger because you do have to buy in multiples of five. We did see where Pike's Place and other Starbucks coffees were on sale at Kroger for $6.99 a pound. Actually, 12, I guess 12 ounces is what it is now. Uh, and, you know, I think Starbucks might have always been 12 ounces, but I know Dunkin' Donuts used to be a pound. Um, but, yeah, they're all part of the buy 10, save 2, buy 15, save 4, and that does include the pods. But, again, uh, a little cheaper at Kroger on sale this week, and that will be going on until Tuesday. And, yes, today is Sunday, May 22nd, so uh, this sale will last until next Saturday, everything we see here pretty much. And then... At Kroger, the sales will end on Tuesday the 24th. So anything we talk about from Kroger's, you'll have a couple days to go in and get those sales. Um, but yeah, uh, lots of sales on coffee this week. I appreciate who uh, mentioned this. It does look like the McCafe is part of it. Uh, $7.99 for the McCafe. What's this one? Okay, the 8 o'clock K-Cups are on sale for $4.49. An amazing deal on the Folgers this week too here at Meyer. Got a lot of Folger drinkers on the channel here. Seven forty-nine. Uh, we've seen that regular. It is on sale for eight forty-nine at Kroger on their buy five deal. Um, Ten seventy-nine here for uh, these are varieties, but the classic roast to thirty point five ounces. They also have the Folgers decaf part of this deal too. Seven forty-nine, and it's on the buy ten, uh, save two or buy fifteen dollars worth, save four. So, pretty good deal here at Meyer does look like Meyer is pretty well stocked on teas. They never uh, really carry as much as Kroger, but it, you know, one thing they do have, looks like Twinnings tea has been on sale pretty much everywhere we've gone. We saw that it was on sale at Kroger. It is down $1, $5.99. So one thing I wanted to check here, I think this is the, nope, that's not the, oh wait. Yeah, that is the glass jar. Okay, somebody was asking about the glass jar Lipton tea. This is the diet. Um, I think that's the only one they got. That is $4.89 for that. That is the glass jar, though, that somebody was asking about. That's a very small one. They do have the bigger canister here. Uh, much better deal, too. But, yeah, got lots of teas. Been getting a lot of comments on tea lately, so I just wanted to point out Myers got a bunch. So we have been seeing a lot of juice go out the door lately, but I gotta say, Myers looks like they're pretty loaded down here. Uh, it's a lot more than what Kroger had. A lot more than we saw at Walmart. Walmart was very low on juice. Now they are out of a lot of the ones they were out of a few months ago, like the Capri Suns, Kool-Aid, stuff like that. Um, this has always been a struggle to get in. We always get comments about this stuff. A lot of the single juices and stuff like that we never can find. We got some Minute Maid apple juice up there and some different kinds. Uh, but yeah, I gotta say the juice aisle here looks pretty good. Somebody had asked about the Jiffy All-Purpose Baking Mix. Found it here, but you couldn't find any. They also have the Bisquick. Somebody had asked about a while ago. Uh, we haven't seen this anywhere. $3.79 a box. They also have the Meyer brand Jalapeno Cheddar. That's interesting. All those are for the biscuits. But yeah, they got the Jiffy. A lot of comments on flour. I won't go over all of it here, but it looks like Meyer. they never carry too much, but they do have a lot of the different types of King Arthur gold medal and their own brand down here for way cheaper uh $1.59 we saw that it was a $1.56 for the same size bag at Aldi so very comparable uh you know we're seeing a lot of that with Aldi now not as cheap uh, as it used to be still great deals at Aldi but you know not like what it used to be and here's the equal that I was talking about a couple people had commented on this so Myers is the only place that we've seen the equal you do have the Sweet and Low Splenda, and, you know, been cut, getting comments about sugar, too, and sugar is, yeah, I don't know, it seems a lot lower. Not as, not as low here as it is as, like, Kroger and some other places, but they do still have a few Domino. So what's up with the peanut butter? I don't know. <laughs> it is gone. It is gone because there has been yet another recall on peanut butter, and we were affected. Yeah. Our numbers came up online as ones that we need to throw away. It's funny that they don't say go get your money back, but I have heard that you can take it to where you got it, that you don't need a receipt, apparently. Uh, we don't know that yet. We bought ours at Sam's Club, so we'll find out. But um, yeah, check the numbers online to see if the numbers fall in line with the recall, because it's it's 
must have been going on for a while because we bought ours like a couple months ago. So uh, make sure you check for that. I am kind of surprised to even see any peanut butter. We saw a Target, they had completely taken all of it off. So I don't know, I wouldn't even buy that. I don't know. Okay, so I wanted to check out another one here that was missing everywhere a couple months ago. Seems to be very low all across the city again are the Pillsbury uh, biscuits. Now they are on sale two for four dollars that could be part of it but they even the ones that aren't on sale we're finding that a lot of them are missing now there was a ton of them at the Kroger marketplace um, but pretty much every other store we've been to they've been very low or none and um, you know I mean they got a few but this was something a few months ago that everybody was asking about we couldn't find them anywhere somebody probably thought I was crazy when I said it's almost three dollars a brick for Philadelphia cream cheese $2.89. I believe it's $2.99 at Kroger. We've just recently been looking over this again lately because we've been hearing it's been going away again. And as we see, another store brand, Myers, is out. We saw at Kroger's. Theirs was out also. They didn't have any of their version of cream cheese. So that's two stores, two major grocery chains where we can't find their version of cream cheese. Probably because it's a lot cheaper. $1.59 and people are becoming less and less picky. But if you're a Philadelphia fan, I have a feeling this might be going away again, so buy up a couple and save it. So I was just telling Jess that we haven't seen many buy five, save five deals here. I mean, I think the best one is probably the pop because that's the most expensive. I feel like you'll get the most out of your money. 24 pack for $6.49 a piece with that deal is a great deal because 24 packs have been anywhere from 10 to 11 to $12. So, but I want to show they got Twinkies part of this deal. Okay, so I wanted to point out that the Meyer vegetables are still 59 cents. Someone told us that the vegetables had gone up some in some of their stores. Someone said 89 cents a can. Uh, they are still 59 cents a can here. And I wanted to point out here, someone that has been asking for this for a little while, did find some spinach. Canned spinach. Um, this is the only, the Meyer brand is the only one I've been able to find here. Didn't see any of uh, the other name brands of spinach. So I don't know. At least uh, Meyers is getting their version in here. You do see that Kroger's is now the same price as uh, Meyer here for the Del Monte vegetables. A lot of mix and mat, a lot of mixed numbers here. Uh, some of them, like the whole new potatoes, are dollar thirty-nine. Green beans, corn, peas, all those are going to be a dollar twenty-nine a piece. Um, and they do sell four packs um, where you got to get like either green beans or corn, but they are four ninety-nine. That's pretty much at every store. Uh, we still get ours at Sam's Club. Still less than a dollar a can when you buy eight of them. So, much better deal there. But yeah, I'm not seeing uh, any spinach from any other brand here. Just the, oh wait, look at this. Here it is. Del Monte, fresh cut chopped spinach, $1.39 a can. Um, so they got this one and the Meyer brand. So of course, another thing that we needed for the meatloaf tonight that Jessica's gonna make is Kraft barbecue sauce, none. Craft is gone. We're gonna have to keep an eye on this one because we got a comment that somebody couldn't find any craft. Oh, really? Yeah. So, barbecue sauce. I don't know about. Uh, we saw some macaroni and cheese back there, but yeah, we'll definitely have to keep an eye on the barbecue sauce. Also, if you like sweet baby rays, that is part of the buy five, save five deal. We haven't seen many of these. Not many. This is probably the fourth or fifth one that we've seen. We saw the pop. We saw the Twinkies, a couple other things, and uh, sweet baby rays sauce. But yeah, I haven't seen many of the buy five deal. Okay, so we have seen that there's been a bit of a run on Miracle Whip lately. We've gotten a lot of comments on it. However, not the problem here. We haven't seen any missing yet, but I bet we will because we've had a lot of people saying they haven't been able to find it. It is part of the buy five and say five dollars. Uh, so yeah, if you have a Myers near you, uh, if you were the one of the ones that have asked about it, I would check Myers. Um, that's a you know that's a pretty decent deal. It brings it down to three forty nine. So definitely, you know, a little cheaper, $1.20 cheaper. Okay, so as most of you know who have been watching lately, we have been showing a lot of stores being very low on cereal, and Myers is no different. Uh, we saw where one Kroger's we went to was pretty empty, and this was another thing a few months ago. It was really hard to find cereals. Very low on a lot of different cereals here. This is pretty crazy. Uh, we're seeing the same things that happened a few months ago, so when you find something you like, whether it's on sale or not, I recommend buying up a couple, buy up a few, uh, and just put it away, because who knows? So Jessica just noticed that there are some 
General Mills cereals that are part of the buy five and save five dollars too. Uh, looks like we got some Lucky Charms, uh, some other ones down here, Captain Crunch, uh, Cinnamon Toast Crunch, and is Kellogg's on it too? This, Apple Jacks? Yeah. Okay, so this one Apple is too. Apple Jacks is... Uh, they don't have a lot. Yeah, I mean, Frosted Flakes <laughs> is supposed to be... It's the bigger size boxes. Yeah. For two forty nine. dollars I mean, that's a good deal with the buy five deal. Yeah, they're out of a lot. A lot of the stuff we like anyway. Okay, so it's been a little while, but I came across this here because we couldn't find this a little while back. So a couple people have asked uh, about Crystal Light. Crystal Light packs you put in your water. Uh, it is part of the buy five and save five deal, but a huge display of it right here. So I just wanted to point this out, bring these to $1.49 a piece. Doesn't seem too bad. Regular price, $2.79 just for this small box. Well, that was our trip to Meyer. A lot of missing stuff. Yeah. Uh, we came here with a, you know, we wanted to do a memorial sale week, see what kind of sales we could get. We did get a lot of good deals. Yeah. Uh, the hamburger for $1.99 is amazing. Thank you to our buddy up north who pointed that out to us. And um, yeah, a lot of little things we, we couldn't find. Uh, not as many of the buy five deals as like what Kroger has. No, that's weird. But anyway, what we wanted to really show you here is our new car. Hey. Me, me and Jess got a new car. My car was dying. Uh, all things were kind of breaking down. It was costing me a fortune. But I know everybody has been asking you know, if we had found a car yet, and I appreciate everybody that was wanting to to help us, you know, find a car and look for us and stuff. Uh, we had been looking at cars for a while. We wanted to get a Honda, something that we can travel to do these videos for years to come. And, you know, this is a something that should last us a long time. Little, little more than we wanted to do at first, but, you know, this was a good investment, I think. And uh, it'll definitely get us on our travels. And guys, thank you so much for all your kind support and heartwarming comments. And, you know, we can't thank you enough for that. So we got our new car. Yippee! Pretty awesome. Uh, this will get us from A to B. Yeah. Everywhere we got to go to bring you guys the deals. Check out the situations and everything. Uh, Myers, you know, there are a lot of great sales today. So um, I would check it out. Uh, you have until next Saturday, uh, Memorial Day weekends, next Saturday. So get your stuff for your grill outs and all your snacks. Those cotton candy grapes are amazing. Yeah. They're absolutely delicious. Best ones I've had here are at Meyer. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching today. With all that being said, we are out. And always remember the adventure. It's out there.